Hi, this is Steve Davis over at Total Wealth Academy, and this is Misconception Monday. The misconception I want to deal with right now is that people think you have to put 20% down to buy rental property, plus the rehab. That is not correct. That is because people really don't know what they're doing. There's a thing out there called a bridge loan or a hard money loan that does not require 20% down, and in many cases, it's actually zero down. And the wonderful thing about a bridge loan or hard money loan is that it includes the rehab. So let's say that you go out and you find a $200,000 rent property that you can buy and rehab for $150,000. Using a bridge loan, they will give you 75% of the ARV after repaired value. In this case, the after repaired value is $200,000. 75% of that is 150. Well, your purchase price and rehab are 150. That's a zero down deal. Now, that is rare. There are a lot of them, but as a percentage, it's relatively rare. See, what we're doing is we go out and buy distressed property, property that needs a lot of rehab. Because of that, we can use the hard money loan and because of that, it won't even qualify for a conventional loan. So the 20% down loan is out of the question. You have to use a bridge loan or a hard money loan to buy this type of property. They give us the money to purchase it and the rehab all in one loan. What this does is it keeps our down payment to a minimum, allowing us to buy dozens of properties Whereas if you use conventional loans, you may only be able to buy three or four. So the misconception is you have to put 20% down. That is false. We're doing deals zero down. And just last month, one of our members, Linda, did a deal where she closed the deal and walked away from the closing table with $12,000. How many deals can you do if you can walk away from every deal with $12,000? It's infinite. So do not use conventional loans to buy rental property. You want to use bridge loans or hard money loans. That's Misconception Monday. Thanks for watching.